In this presentation, I am going to help you write a summary. But what is a summary? A summary is a shorter version of another text. For example, might know. I'm going to give you some tips to write your summaries of might know. Look at the first page on the first tip. It says read each page until you understand it. And if you don't understand, ask your teacher. Now, look at this part of the sentence. It says that he was not a big fan of homework. This might be confusing because it says that he was not a big fan of homework. But was he a fan of homework or not? Did he like homework or not? So if you find more confusing sentences, please ask your teacher. Now look at page two and tip number two. It says underline the most important part of each page. And you can skip some pages. For example, the first one. These are the most important parts of page number two. My summary starts here with information I found on page two. So I skipped page one. Now look at this page again and the third tip. It says write your summary with your own words. Look at the first sentence. It says, most seem to be a kid just like any other. Now, when you're writing, use your words because it will be easier for you to remember. So, this sentence says, most seem to be a kid just like any other. But I would say, most seem to be a normal boy because it's easier to write, it's shorter, and it's easier to remember. Now, look at the last tip. It says, revise and correct your mistakes. It says, most seem to be a normal boy. But remember that the verbs in the past go with ed if they are regular. And this one only has a d. So, I read it again and corrected it. 